We're bringing the keyboard. That's how much you like this, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pardon? Well, um, I'm not sure. Yeah, nice. Watch it up here. Girls, it's very special. I really hope you all enjoy it, especially the pleasure of Sheila Brude and all the assembled vice members. Thank you all so much for coming. Once upon a time, Shri Krishna was deeply thinking of Srimati Radharani. He was feeling such acute pains of separation from her that he fainted and was completely unconscious. Then, as if by providential arrangement, Narada Rishi and Uddhava came there and saw Shri Krishna lying unconscious. Knowing everything, they could understand that the cause of his condition was separation from Srimati Radharani. Oh, Narada, we must do something. Our dear Lord Krishna is unconscious due to deep separation from the gopis. Especially Srimati Radharani, whom we cannot live without. Consolation to Nanda Maharaj, Yashoda Mata, the Gopis, and Srimadhi Radharani. <coughs> they are feeling the acute pang of separation from Krishna. My language failed. My mission failed. They are crying for Krishna. Day and night, 24 hours. If someone here in the material
material world loses his near one and dear one. He cries day and night. Nobody cries for Krishna. So then one may say, why are you crying? Everything in this material world is temporary. One who is born must die someday. Death is certain. No one can check it. They are crying for the Krishna. And if someone is crying for Krishna, who is the object of love, how can you say don't cry? Brother, my heart says cry more, cry more, cry more. Therefore, my mission failed. I could not give them any consolation. At last, I told them, I will go back to Mathura and try my best to send Krishna back to Vrajbhumi immediately. I have given my word to them. But until now, it has not taken place. So after so many months and years, if I go back to Vrajbhumi and speak like this, they will not put any faith in my words. Rather, they will scold me like a cheater. No, Dava, you are a liar. You promised us this before. But Krishna did not come back. So how can I go? My dear friend Uddhava, I am considering what you have said, and I agree. Balaramji, perhaps it is better that you should go to Braj Bhumi first. Oh, Narda, I would have gone to Braj Bhumi long ago. I would not have waited for anyone. But please consider this. Your Lord Krishna always said, yes, I'll go, I'll go, I'll go. But he was not actually going. He was only procrastinating. I have been to Braj Bhumi. And I have seen the condition of the Rajbasis. I was there for two months, and I also was able to console them. I tried to tell them, please, have patience. Krishna will return soon. Do not feel so much distress. But their condition is like the fish out of water. I understood clearly that without the presence of Krishna, Nothing would give them consolation. They cannot survive at all. It, although they are dying, feeling the pangs of separation from Krishna, and yet he has not gone there. Krishna's <coughs> presence would be a soothing balm to them. He would give back their lives, especially a Shadow. She is always crying when I went to Prajpumi. I touched her lotus feet and I said, Oh, Mother, as soon as I return to Rajpuri, as soon as I return to Dwarka, I will make my best effort to send Krishna to Rajpuri. Please, wait for some days, Mother. I did it. I gave my word to Mother Yashoda. But what happened? <coughs> so many times I requested, My dear brother Krishna, Please, go to Raj Bhumi immediately. Suspend everything. Give up all your work here and go to Raj Bhumi. Otherwise, they will all die. So many times I requested, Krishna, please make them survive. Your presence would be a soothing balm, the medicine to save their lives. If you do not go, their lives shall surely get out. So many times I asked this. Previously, 
Whatever request I made, that Krishna would carry out immediately. But he has not carried out this request. He simply says, yes, I'll go, I'll go. Oh, Harda, you are all knowing. So please, tell me, if I were to go to Brad Bhumi, what would I tell Mother Yashoda? I have already promised her that Krishna would return. So what shall I say? Will Mother Yashoda put faith in my words? She will never. Rather, she will say, Balaram, you are a liar. <laughs> Alas, my dear Rajvasis, are you still surviving? My dear brother Krishna, your heart is as soft as butter. How strange it is that such a soft heart has become as hard as a block of stone. All of you, please be patient and give up your anxiety. I will go to Brad I'll first go and sit on the lap of Mother Yashoda, wiping the tears from her eyes and I'll say, Oh, Mother, Krishna is coming just now. My two brothers and I started from Dwarka simultaneously. But along the road, many people have assembled to greet him. They have constructed big gates, so many kings are standing at the roadside. Innumerable people are carrying arty plates just to offer puja to Krishna. So he is coming a bit later. But I have come in advance just to give you this good news. He's coming, Krishna is coming. <laughs> Similarly, I will go to each gopi, wipe the tears from their eyes, and console them. I'll tell them. Male persons are a little crippled, but we, females, are very simple. I am a woman, so when they hear from me that Krishna is coming, they'll believe me and put faith in my words. Then all the Rajvasis will become so happy and make arrangements for a great festival to welcome Krishna. Yes, this is a wonderful proposal. Yes, it's a wonderful idea. Yes, let us proceed at once. Oh, but how can I allow my dear brother and sister to go alone? No, Subhadra is going first. I will accompany her. Yes, you should both go. After your departure, Narada Muni will sing Rajalila Kahani with his Veena. And Lord Krishna will wake up and we will send him immediately.
difficulty, Narada and Uddhava caught hold of Krishna and placed him on the chariot. Then Narada ordered Daruka to drive the chariot to Braja, and Daruka drove as swiftly as the wind. In the meantime, Baladev's chariot and Subhadra's chariot had reached Rajabhumi. When Balaram saw the Brajvasi's condition, an ecstatic mood manifested in his body. Then the same transformation also took place in Subhadra, and she could not go to Yashodamata because she had become completely ecstatic. It was as if these two forms were drowning in that ocean of sweetness of the mellow of Raja. Meanwhile, at Radha's kunj in Nidhuvan, her condition was gradually becoming worse. All her sakis were doubtful whether or not there was any life in the body of Radharani. She was lying there with her head resting on the palm of Lalita's hands. Her sakis were all sitting around her. They could not understand what to do. Radharani was giving up her body. She could not survive. The whole of Rajabhumi was in complete anxiety. to take some dust from your lotus feet on my symphony. Today I really became a chaste lady. I had a great pride, as great as a kashachumbi. I was always proclaiming, I am the only chaste lady in Rajmuni. All others are prostitutes. I used to say that. I have tried my best to prove that you are a great prostitute. 
you have no chastity at all. Although you are married to my brother, you are always running to Krishna. And so I try my best to prove that you are most unchaste, and that I am most chaste. But once, a very mysterious thing happened. Krishna manifested Leela, as if deathly ill with a terrible fever. This fever had come, and all the Vajrasis were in great anxiety. How could Krishna be cured? What was the medicine? Of all the Vajrasis, we were told that only a lady who was very chaste and pure could bring the medicine. If such a lady could go to the Jamuna, carrying a pot that had a hundred holes, and bring back water without spilling a single drop, that would be the medicine to cure Krishna. All the Vajrasis decided that I was the most chaste lady. They said, Kutil is always beating drums and proclaiming that she is the only chaste lady. There are no other chaste ladies in Rajbhumi. So they said, call Kutila. Let her bring water from the Jamuna without spilling a single drop. They gave the pot to Kutila. dreams he only thinks of you, never me. This is all a Leela created by Yoga Maya. She has made us dance here in Vajbhumi. And for the pleasure of Krishna, in whatever way she made us dance, we all danced. I know it well. Everyone here is engaged in helping in Krishna's leelas. Nothing else. Today, Today, I heard that you are dying. If you give up your body, no one in this branch room will survive. Oh, Radhe, not a single animal. Everyone will die. Then Krishna, Krishna will never come back. We will never see Krishna. 
develop this mode eternal to Krishna. And he should be very high class of devotees in the line of devotees like Rukmini Devi I am praying to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. I am praying to Nityananda Prabhu to sprinkle their mercy for which they have descended to come. And now I'm seeing that very far away from Vrindavan, lakhs and lakhs smiles opposite in this world from Vrindavan. In Vrindavan, that is Vrindavan, and opposite to the other world, there is perhaps morning, morning four, four or five. And here is now like this. But even there is no culture like Indian culture. But by the 
grace of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and his associates. This very rare and highest mode of Vrindavan Braj eh? now descended in new Braj. Mm. I think the mission of Srila Prabhupada Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur Bhakti Vinod Thakur and the mission of Sri uh, Bhakti Vedanta Swami Maharaj and my Guru in our successful. That even rare, but you are one of the rares, the devotees and pleasure. So try to keep these things forever in your life and eternal in your life. Don't deviate from this life. I'm praying also Radha Krishna conjugal. Jogmaya. Uddha. Narada also. That they should sprinkle their mercy. Without their help, without their mercy, anyone cannot have this rare mood. This mood also Nara wants, <coughs> but he has not this set. Whether he has become dust or not dust in Vrindavan, Uddha, Narada also, we don't know. Anywhere in Shastri is not written. But you are so fortunate to have this rare mood in you. So try to keep it here safe, very safe, and so that gradually it will come develop. So my heart will bless it to you. Also my mission is also <coughs> successful, that we are inspired to play a drama like this. I think in world, anywhere, we will not fight a drama like this. Uh, <laughs> <very difficult. laughs> I want to request all the devotees of New Braja. Then they should leave Brother Hadley, that we are all, all in God family. And try to develop all these things. You will never see in, have anywhere in, you will go to India, in Haridwar, in South India, you will go to Kashi, you will not find all these things. Anywhere in world. This world. So I want that. <coughs> these things to be protected and try to develop. I want that they should all be together and they should in one week or two weeks, they should assemble anywhere, <coughs> discuss all these things as a broad, yeah, broad brotherhood. Hmm? Like we are brother and sister. <coughs> and thus, we should try to develop all these things. And I think very soon, very soon, Krishna will be merciful, Mahaprabhu will be merciful to take you all in prayer. So I request all that they should, I also want that there should be a school here. So that children may be education. In this line, so I am requesting and praying you all that you should assemble, make a uh, samiti means society. society and go on with this. This is the best way to follow or to, um, to develop or to fulfill the inner desire of your Gurudev, Srila Bhakti Vedan Swami Maharaj, Srila Bhakti Siddhan Saraswati Mahaprabhu and Pabha. And by doing this, you will be very so happy. I want that there should be no friction. Have tolerance and try to each other helping in Krishna consciousness. I'm so much uh, indebted to these girls, being the girls, teeny age or little boys, and how they knew this mood of pleasure. Very rare. So you should be these notes in your heart and try to develop Krishna consciousness. 
I will not divorce. Will not divorce. Ah. Women. Oh, so you should also promise the women. So you that you will be helpful in my devotional life. I will be helpful. Okay. Ah, look. <laughs> I will see also, and if I will see that you are doing that, I will have to punish you. <laughs> and I will tell Krishna to punish you. <laughs> <laughs> so you should be very strong, very good character. No? Always in service mode. You are always to help him. Don't see that, oh, she is my mm, what? Servant. Maid servant. Never like this. Never want to cheat each other. Have belief and loving affection. Go, Praman. You should text Buddha Prabhu like your Shiksha Guru. Understand? <coughs> and you can be in bath. Helping me in my my computer projects. Sometimes mm, composing also. Sometimes coming to India and handling my balls in computer if any defect or anything. Very strong. You are also so qualified. You can help in my projects. Like service, serving me. Oh, oh, can we have your blessings to conceive a child? What? Spawn doing? What Krishna misses? Don't be very far. Devotion is God. Don't be very far. Gurudev said the other day, devotion, bhakti is child of, uh, of Shraddha. Was it? Bhakti is child of Shraddha. Yeah. You can develop your Krishna concept. And start in my project. Try to learn some Hindi and computer very soon, you know? Now you should learn computer. Or he has. She can do other things. She has so many qualifications. No problem. She has good character. <laughs> Gurudev has to take his breakfast now. So please, let's. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Oh, you have not a... Uh, Alpha one, one more talk. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. 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 Hare Krishna.
Actually, there's some place here. Yeah. There's some place here. What's your game? Go. <laughs> you remember in Bhuvaneshwar at Krishna Das's, he has some family members? And you made me sit on the bed? Oh, yeah. yeah. Remember? <laughs> And then I wouldn't sit, and they pushed me onto the bed. Why not here? I'm not For many, many reasons. <laughs> <laughs> but I right here that uh, something lacking in me. <laughs> that Ramchandra said something lacking. That he could not take with Lakshman, Bharat, Satrugna, and uh, Vibhishan being a Mitra, friend, friend and also Sugri. So Ramchandra has something like that. They, they are fearing to sit here. So this is not, li not lacking of friends, but lacking of... But in Krishna, no lacking. His devotees should have no lacking that thing. <laughs> if, I, if, I, if I sit here, then everyone will leave. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I never talk to him. Never talk to him. All the things. So. Then they will say, "Oh, so near and dear." <laughs> so they will pay respect. To you. Oh, that's <laughs> so puffed up. Where is Mula Prakriti? No, she's she's very sick. Sick, sick, stomach, head, and she also heard uh, that I know that she has wept, weak, yes. mental is hurt, and weeping. That is why headache. Mm -hmm. Sometimes she becomes. She also uh, she heard that you wouldn't speak this morning, so she thought oh, I'll do some household duty. I thought that I should meet together today. I think she'll come down, maybe she can say goodbye. Uh, tell her that uh, she she'll come in the evening and she should be here. She would yeah. be here if she knew you were speaking. But she didn't know. she thought Maharaj won't speak, so I won't go. But I'm not to speak <coughs> anything while meeting with you here. You all. I think that my preaching and coming to Vesas is so successful. From beginning from children, girls, sons, long persons, old and senior, all came to my classes and prayed so much. They became so much inspired. Also, they inspired me. Like Parikshit Mara inspired Sukhdev Goswami and those Sukhdev Goswami. In spite of all the devotees who are here in Shambhala. So I'm so much happy. I'm especially happy that the devotees who are not chanting, they are give up chanting, taking wine or some other bad thing, unwanted thing, they have given up. And now they have some inspiration to chant. To follow the path of them. <coughs> that is why I am so happy. I want that uh, in Bezer. Bezer should be a very famous place of devotees. And from the beginning, all the children of Bezer should be uh, taught. Uh, <coughs> also, the school should be. We went very soon. The school should be there. All boys and children should learn. Uh, also, a study and also Bande Hamsi group, Namo Vishnu Padaya, and doing and chanting little, 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 little. Even one round, it will have very good effect. Then they will not be bewildered here. 
have so much affection for all of you. Uh, all are now energetic. The trauma, especially day before yesterday and yesterday, all the tamas were having so much teachings. But Mahabharata Prabhu did. And perhaps he is the root cause of fear that all his children are coming. And very energetic. I was some worry for his elder son. But quickly he came. And I have shared that half his my son, half Oh, his half son and my whole son. <laughs> So, he has had so much supporting them and nursing them. And how we can develop it without any wall or anything for all issues. So that our faith and courage should come in Swamiji, Matiridan Swamiji. And we should go in his mind. When I will reach to India, I will hear that our school has been started. <coughs> and we are all okay. And after seven days or when you will lie in uh, weekend or in fifteen days, there must be some classes. He is so expert and qualified in all this. His wife is also so more, more sweet and more qualified. So they should be engaged in giving training to other and taking classes. So you should arrange. And I will be happy to hear all these things. All these things are. I want that anyone should not leave this place going to here and there. I want that more devotees should come here. Oh, there are very so much facilities. Our children can go to school. Sometimes we will be in these classes, Harikatha, Shankirtan. I introduced like Govardhan Puja here. So sometimes festivals can be done. Chariot festival can be done here. Or others. So thus we can develop our Krishna. I want that all hearts can be developed in Krishna consciousness. We don't want any single uh, eyes that is in the sense of dollars or anything. We want to have this. If coming easily, then we can engage in Krishna service. Otherwise, we want that our hearts should be developed and we should weave for Krishna. More we for Srimati Radhika. Tavai Vashmi. Tavai Vashmi. Tavai Vashmi. Najima Vitoya. Iti Pinya. Radhika, I cannot live without you. Never, never, never. So please, please give your mercy to me. Sprinkle your mercy. I am only your friend. Even Krishna will call. Oh, come on, come on. And I say, no. I am going to serve my Aradhya Devi Shimati Dhani. Then Krishna will be more happy. But oh, she wants to. This is about the object of Mahaprabhu to come to this world. But be careful for Mayabhar. But I think he has no Mayabhar. But it may be in other centers. Huh? 
be very careful for, for offensive. Don't criticize any bush. Whatever he is doing, let him do. But you should not. He may abuse you. He may do anything. But if he is chanting, remembering Krishna, then don't take his anything. But you can do that. You can have. Uh, you should not have his association, but don't criticize. Like I don't criticize anyone. But if the difference of Shiddhan, no compromise. You, are, you can have some honor in Shiddhant, no compromise. Like Swamiji, like my Gurudev, more strict than thunderbolt, no compromise. But behavior should be strict. Like Swamiji used to play with very little, little boys, I have seen. I was so merciful. Our Guru was, Maharaj was so strong. But in his old days, I have seen that he became like boys, all junior uh, disciples of my Guru. They used to be on his court and to like all <laughs> like here sometimes they do to me. <laughs> Have tolerance. If anyone is doing like this and you'll at once be angry. No, don't. If you want Krishna pain, be very grave. Be tolerance. Pinadapi Suni Chin, Tarodapi Sakishuna, Amadina Madri, Krithani Yasana. If you want to chant Krishna with love and affection, then at once, quickly, have a qualification like Trina Cross. More than grass, more than grass. If you keep your feet on that, it will go down, but when you will take your feet up, and they will again, but questions are more than that. The grasses are not intelligent and not like human senses, but questions should be more. Tolerance than more than tree, you know that. Krishna is glorifying to Baldev Prabhu the qualities of trees, always giving shade. They have no partiality. No partiality. Anyone has come to cut that tree, but he can see it in his shade. His bark, his roots, his juice, his leaves. Flowers, fruits, wood, everything is for others, not for others. And if a man is, has, cut, uh, has come to cut the tree and he is giving some stone, he will give fruit. So, Trina, the api, Suni, Chena, Taro, Rapi, Sarisuna. What is the meaning of taror api? More than three. And then judge your heart. Hmm? In how deep water you are. What, what is the meaning? We yes, should compare with trees. Have you tolerance like that? have qualities to give up everything to devotees or anyone, like trees, no partiality. Trees never criticizes anyone, never does any offense. 
I think if any fruit any devotees will take and he will go there and he will have some shade there. Anyhow, he will take any service from that tree. Quickly he will be a pure devotee in his next life. So, so we should try to be like that. This life is so precious, so precious. Again we will be human but we are not. not so quickly from today, we should try to go to any Guru Vaishnava qualifier, be associated, and then initiated, and begin your service from today. Because Parikshit Maharaj has seven days, we have no seven days. Any day we can go, just now we can go. There were so many 300 persons in a uh, ship, aeroplane. Ship, aeroplane. And at first it was just smashed and what became? Nowhere. Anyone did it return to tell what we happened to You see that in, in wars, great work, oh, thousands and thousands. In Mahabharata war, in only 18 days, more than 18 lakhs were finished. It may come some earthquake or hydrogen and nitrogen bomb are more than that. They can finish. But soul will not be finished. So from today, we should give them unwanted things very strongly chanting, remember. What I gave you in seven days here, I was not in a position to speak two times, three times, four times what I was doing in these old days. I have nothing to gain from you. You cannot give me anything. Only you can give inspiration to speak. If you are giving some money, what I will do? No, nothing. You cannot give anything more. You can give me some clothes or anything, utensil, computer, but I don't know how to. <laughs> <laughs> if anyone gives, I will tell you, oh, go in the proper way. You should take it and do something or anything. So I want only this thing, pure hearts that I can help them and they should quickly follow Swamiji, Guru Parampara and thus serving Radha Krishna Kanjival or Sri Chaitanya. These are my finishing words. I cannot tell anything more than that. But I have so much affection for you all. <coughs> without any guilt and selfishness, nothing. Nirgun Prabhu, Govinda Prabhu, Madan Prabhu, Rajendra Prabhu, has dragged me here. I have come. I want again and again. It may be I cannot tour so much, but I will like to come here to see how my boys and children are. How I, I uh, nourish some seeds that Swamiji had planted. And also I have now some seeds. So I must come to see and to again some noti uh, knowledge. <coughs> So this is very strong. Whether children or bigger ones, always try to honor all Vaishnavas who are chanting the You were speaking about Mayavadiism, and I just was thinking, and I had some question. Is this mood to be controller like Purusha Bhava? 
does that have anything to do with Maya Vadiism? Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Can I ask the Vaishnavas to move forward just a little bit? There's many people here that would like to sit down and listen. As far as possible, as far as possible, move one or two inches, whatever. And what you say to a person who is saying to you, I am always worshipping Krishna, I am always surrendered, I am, I am, uh, what I'm doing is always Krishna's will, and yet, and yet, this they're still enjoying. His this would be helped, and uh, I think that uh, someday if we will have bona fide associations, we will change it. In Navdeep I have seen that so many um, senior God brothers, even very educated and learned, knowing all the truths, they are of same opinion that you are doing. Yeah. What I am doing, Krishna. Yeah. Then I told that if what you are doing, everything you are doing, then I wanted to give a slap to him. And then he said, how why you are giving? And if Krishna wanted, I gave him. So why you are not asking? Then he did pranam. And he wanted to be excused. It is a good thing. It, 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 is, it will be in high process of Vaishnava, like the Rupa Goswami. That what he is doing, Krishna is doing. They have mixed their own will to Krishna. So what they are doing, doing for Krishna. So there it can be possible. For us it is impossible. Then you should take a Jalantanga, burning. burning stick <laughs> with, oh. with flame and try to give it in his mouth. <laughs> and then what you are saying? Oh, Krishna is burning. So that is wrong. Gurdajan used to say this. Oh, Krishna, you know everything. What is good and bad? What is dharma? Janami dharmam na chanyami prabhiti Janam na dharmam na chanyami prabhiti Tada hisike sahi bisthite na Yaprani joso shitata karo He is telling all Rishikesh Krishna I know you and myself also I know all kinds of religious things are Ved Upanishad I know but I have no test. I also know what is adharma. Huh? But I have test in that. I know that I am a puppet in your hands. 
you are telling me, inspiring me, I am doing all these things. So, I am not uh, guilty for seeing active, sinful activities that I am doing. I know that gambling, toxication, doing some events to Draupadi, diplomacy, and uh, trying always to finish Pandavas. I know this is bad. But I am thinking that you are. But he was telling only verbally, not verbally. So they are also like demons. But <coughs> so if anyone is telling that that what I am doing, Krishna is doing, I am going to Krishna. Then he will be either high, top class of Mahabhagavad or like topmost, I mean, lowest. <laughs> lowest. <laughs> Not real. This would be some. Uh, reconcile this. No. Merciful. I told some devotees, my God brother, Ishvara, Sarva Bhutana, Hrteshe, Arjuna, Ishtati. Brahmyan, Sarva Bhutani, Janta Rudani, Mayaya. Let give this example <laughs> that Krishna is taking us to do this, that, 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 that. So we are not responsible. responsible. Krishna is responsible. I told that. Brahmyan, Sarva Bhutani, Janta Rudani, Mayaya. What Krishna is telling? Krishna is telling 